y'all this is Brett and this morning I received an email from a viewer thanking me for the videos and it's just a very kind and generous email and I really appreciate that and I appreciate comments that y'all write down below uh, it's just awesome and it makes my day and you know my best friends are my viewers and I'm somebody that just doesn't have a lot of friends because I'm kind of a lone wolf and individualist and you know me if you've been watching me for very long and so thanks so much but I want to read to you what she wrote and what I wrote back and hopefully it will give you some insight for the future and relationships and it doesn't matter if it's a relationship with a lover, a friend, a family member, or whatever, I think this will help you. She writes, I always gave a lot of my heart and time and mind and was tricked a few times, as I trust very openly, and for some reason some people see that as a weakness and my emotional character as a weakness. It has took me years to realize it's not a weakness and you have helped. Especially of late, my daughter's father, I let him in and made myself believe I was worthless and did everything wrong. I'm still working on that. Okay, and I write back, it's hard to be rejected by someone that you open up to. You've got to get stronger and to, that's to be able to deal with this. Time, all in good time maybe not open up so easily yet. You see, the stronger you are, the more you can open up and not sweat poor reciprocation back. Understand that people are not perfect and that they all have needs. Know that people come and people go. And accept that each relationship is a trade and that sometimes they last for a minute and other times for a lifetime. These trades can be an unequal exchange of energy and you may feel as though you've been duped. Don't do that. Allow the energy to flow and it will come back to you from elsewhere. Don't allow your mind to think that you've been tricked. Have fun with relationships. Build energy because the more energy you have, the more you won't worry about giving it out freely. I'm going to say that again. And this, this is the whole deal with all of this better diet, better thinking, better lifestyle, better everything. <clears throat> the more energy you have, the more you won't worry about giving it out freely. And that if somebody doesn't give it back to you, it's like, oh, well, that's okay, because guess what? I've still got a big old full bucket of energy that I can use and enjoy all the time. So, enjoy relationships even if, that, even if they're not that serious or not an equal exchange. Also, try to get better intuition as to how much other people are willing to put out and then give what you desire back. So, those are just my thoughts on this and um, I do hope that helps you. Please subscribe if you're not already. Write a comment in the comment box or a thumbs up in the comment box. You can put T-U and um, it's just great to do what I do and I'm regularly feeling better all the time. I go through these cycles of cleansing and healing, breaking down and then building up. But guess what? After each cycle, I'm a little higher than I was before. And I hope you achieve the same thing.